Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Shin Megami Tensei 2. Last time, we finished Chaos, and now we're going to start Law. Um, so, yeah, let's go ahead and start Law. Damn it, I did the same thing. Okay, let's go ahead and start Law. Um, we need to make sure we never save over File 2. As long as we do that, um, we should be fine. We should be able to go to the post-game dungeon before actually beating the game if we do that. Hey, wake up! How long are you planning on sleeping, Hawk? Get up already! Hurry up! You made it all the way to the tournament finals. You can't start slacking now. And don't give me any bullshit about not being capable. I may have been the one that saved you when I found you getting attacked by that demon, but I could tell right off from the way that you were fighting that thing that you were a natural. Also, hang on a minute. Am, is my voice being recorded? Yes. Yet yeah, No. Yes. Okay. Oh, but the desktop isn't being recorded. Okay. <laughs> okay, but that's an easy fix. There we go. Especially the way you were able to hold your own despite being in that drunken stupor. Don't give me that face. You better be glad I saved your sorry ass. And remember, in your test run through the Virtual Battler, you not only made the high score, but literally went through it unscathed. That's skill. And don't be forgetting that one, that I was the one that paid for that run. After all, you couldn't even remember your own name when I found you. Who else would have taken you in? You make a hell of a gladiator too, thanks to me, of course. Hawk's a pretty cool sounding name for one, too, don't you think? Ah, this formerly studentless old man's luck has finally turned. Anyhow, until you win the championship and get us both out of this hellhole, no slacking. I'm not going to let that asshole Hanada show me up any longer. Crap. Sorry about the rambling. You got me, though. Yes. Then get your ass up and start today's training. Go and do a run through in the virtual trainer. Okay. Okay, Hawk. Ready, set, go. Okay, so I forgot to look at one thing real quick. So if I remember correctly, um, for this playthrough. I need, I know I need to level up magic. Um, do I need to level up speed or luck, though? I think I need to level up speed. Yeah, whatever. Ba -ba 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 -da. <laughs> okay, hang on. Hang on, 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 hang on. Okay, so law, it's magic, and where's the other one? I know there's another one. Oh, wait. It's magic and luck. Oof. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. Ba, 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 da. ba 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 da. ba 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 da. ba 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 I don't need luck, I need speed. 
Okay. Okay, it's magic and speed. In that... No. In that case, I'm going to increase speed before magic, because speed is a lot more useful. Speed increases my hit chance, which increases accuracy. So... They're definitely more useful. This feels so wrong. The, the law route goes against your... <laughs> your instincts as a melee-only character. Like, s s so does the fucking neutral route, kind of. I guess intelligence and luck are useful, though. A lot more useful than fucking magic and speed. Because intelligence can make it so that recruiting demons is easier, and luck increases, um... Uh, critical hit chance, which would then increase attack. But speed and magic. Magic does nothing. I don't think magic does anything for Hawk or Aleph. And then speed increases hit percentage and evasion. Also, for this one, I'm going to increase strength because, God, I, I need some strength. Can't let this game fuck me over... The entire playthrough. Let me level up one more time. Magic. What the fuck does magic do? It increases my magic power. That's so great, because I don't- I don't have that! I don't fucking have magic power! Undead zombie. There we go. Okay, good job. Stop there. It's so bad! Yo, nice job there. What will you do? I'm gonna fucking save. Resting oneself is integral. Take it easy. Kick back. This one. Yo, Hawk, wake up. Did you sleep well? I'm leaving. Here, take this. Use it for the public virtual battler scattered around town to train yourself. I should be fine. Oh, shit. Wait, does it remember? Oh my god, it remembers! Shit, again, I lost everything in the casino. It remembers from my last playthrough. Oh my god, is that real? Is that true? Please tell me that that is true. That that's like 100% true. I need that. Hello, fortune teller. I shall clear your worries. Stole your fortune for free. See a name, a woman's name. She's very important to you. Do you remember her name? Yes. Alrighty. I don't think this one actually matters. Yeah, this one doesn't matter. Oh well, I'll still do it. So you've remembered. Her name is Hiroko, correct? Yes. <laughs> Hiroko, do not ever forget that name. Her fate is inexorable. Her fate is entwined with your own.
<laughs> Welcome to my Hinata Gym. Well, who do we have here? If it isn't the Soul Warrior from that rundown Okamoto Gym, I bet you can't get any decent training in that grumbly old gym. How would you like to join mine? You're pretty cute too, just my type. You can never have too many handsome young warriors. Anyways, if you'd like to use my top-of-the-line virtual trainers, you're welcome to them. I won't let you train for free, of course. But if you're interested, just ask one of the gym members. Of course, no matter how hard you train, you'll never be able to stand up to my warrior Red Bear. <laughs> yeah. That's really expensive. Use Jim and Valhalla. These several warriors who became champion. Yeah, I remember this place. My map doesn't. Okay, so. Might not be as awesome as I first thought. I don't want to die. You look pretty tough. Okay. Alright. All sorts of people go to the bar to relax. If you're looking for information, go there. Where's the virtual battler? There it is. Here. There we go. Hey there! Hi. I'm not a demon. I'm a person just like you. And I came into this virtual battle so I could meet you. My name is... Call me Steven. I'm here because there's something I want to give you. Here. This is my demon summoning program that I wrote. You can download it to your arm terminal directly through the virtual interface here. There has been an incident, and because of it, very soon, Tokyo Millennium here will most likely be overrun with demons. The leaders of this city have been suppressing the demons for a long time, but they can no longer hold out. At this point, nothing can stop the demons from entering our world. Unless we learn to live with the demons and use their power, we humans will never survive. Therefore, in preparation, I have been given this program to everyone that looks to be able to summon and use demons. I don't know who you are, nor does it matter to me. All I can tell is that you are powerful, and thus I am giving you this program. Do you understand? Yes. Very well. I'm glad that you understand. I shall upload the demon summoning program into your arm terminal. Use it well. See the demon summoning program. I hope you use this program with forethought and moderation. We will most likely meet again. Here in the virtual reality of the virtual battler. I look forward to seeing you again. Goodbye for now. Okay. I'll go away. Oh, yeah, yeah. You want to talk to me? Are you a friend? Yes. Yeah! Welcome to the team. Thanks. You can use that computer to talk to me? Cool, I think I'll become your minion. No, I can't. I can't turn on my friends. Sorry, let's just forget about this. 
damn it. Yes. Okay. Already. Oh, it makes a chaos demon. Sad. Citizens of Valhalla are forbidden entry to the center. What the hell are you doing messing around here? The tournament comes closer every second. Get back to the gym already. up here. Anything? Nice. You're spacing out quite a lot lately. Have you gotten back any of your memories? Just don't pull that shit in the Colosseum, because if you give him an opening, you're as good as dead. If you receive this message, this is... Ah, that's right. He is exceptionally intelligent. Give him a name? Yes. His name is... Ah! His name is Yemel. Gimmel, is this all right? Yes. So his name is Gimmel. Gimmel, this is Gimmel. I am in Arcadia. Okay. 
Alright, great job defeating that slime. Do you want to continue? No. Oh, you're back. Space on quite a lot lately. If you're not broke, head to the virtual battlers. Okay, wait. I think... What the hell are you doing messing around out here? The tournament comes closer every second. Get back to the gym already. Oh, what the fuck do you want from me? Ah, shit. I have to be missing out on something, because... God will send us his messiah soon. Those who believe will all be saved. Welcome to the manor of luck. You got time? Get your ba ass back training. When buying things in the shop, you press down. Oh, it's you, Hawk. Nothing personal, but I don't sell anything to members of Okamoto's gym. Was there something in here? Thought that if I were stronger, I could join Haneda's gym and become one of his warriors. Haneda's gym is to the east of the main town. What are you looking at? It's supposed to be natural to be taken by, by my beauty. You gotta dance. Some town the entire northwest section of Valhalla is closed off. Gotta go to the Colosseum next. Hmm. Constantly borrowing money, blowing it on the casino. You're a hawk, aren't you? Before to be wasting time in a place like this. Some guy in a wheelchair while virtual battling. He's not supposed to be part of the program. Good luck in the championship. The upcoming championship match is going to be Red Bear versus Hawk. Word on the street is that both fighters are pretty evenly matched. Either could win. Can't sell anything to you. Tell him to return to the 1,000 I gave him. There's a guy looking for you. What was he like? Well, among all of you, he has the greatest power. You will give him a name, understand? Yes. His name is... His name is Zayn. Zayn. Zayn is his name? Yes. So his name is Zayn. Hey, what's wrong? 
Listen when someone's talking to you. Name who was, guy who was looking for you. Called himself Zayn. Okay. Are we done? Forgot about that guy. Oh, Hawk, I've been looking for you. Let's head to the Colosseum. You're in tip-top shape, I hope. What do you think? The giant building up to the north there is the Colosseum. It exists solely for you to claim your victory. Alright, hang on. Okay. No. Ah, shit, it's a full moon. This is Millennium News Network. Here's the latest news from Millennium. Earlier this morning, in a secluded corner of Holy Town, 13 Gaians were caught trying to build a temple to another god by several temple knights. The patrol of knights has executed them all on the spot. Remember, we must always be vigilant to make sure that we do not allow or forgive heathens that would disrupt the peace of our great Millennium. Newest demon report. Things are pretty clear today, with no patches of demons reported in any areas of Millennium. The danger level is currently slightly under 1.0 and falling, and we expect it to reach a level of 0.5 by the end of the day. Let us pray that to God that today will be safe. Yeah, okay. The Hall of Fame. Otomo Akira, despite having a small stature, consistently defeated all manner of strong opponents, specialized in using his opponent's power to his own advantage. King Muscle. Yeah. Thomas Tank, extremely hardy fighter. The hero, the first champion, said to have been able to freely summon and control demons at will. Yo, Okamoto, I see you brought along your trainee, Hawk. Now listen, you make sure he doesn't die too quickly. The first, if the fight goes too quickly, the spectators will get pissed and start a riot. Alright, here's the rules. Final battle is a dungeon match. Both you and your opponent will be dropped off in different parts of a big maze, the center of which is set up as an arena. Once the match starts, you will need to work your way through the maze. We've dropped some weapons and items in various places in there. See if you can find them, and they should help you out. To make things interesting, we've released a fairly large number of demons into the maze too. Once both fighters enter the ring, the true fight starts. You can only fight your opponent in the ring. No fighting in the maze if you happen to run into each other there. The winner of the fight will be the first to knock out or kill their opponent, of course. Those are the rules. Got it? Yep. Alright then, hot, go on through. You've come this far. There's nothing more I can do to teach you. Go for it, Hawk. Have confidence in your, in your abilities. You are strong. You will win. You come back alive and in one piece. Got it? Now get on out there and show them what you're made of. Alright everyone, it's time for the main event. The finals of the tournament begin in earnest. Let's introduce our two contenders for the championship. In this corner, we have Red Bear. And in this corner, Hawk. Ready? Go!
Oof. Thanks. Nice. Got a helmet. That's a seedy looking face you've got there. What a moron. There's no hope for you. Give me your soul. Oh yeah, I sounded so cool. Don't be ridiculous. Will you give me something? No. I'm really nasty. Bastard took both of my life stones. I should have just went for it because they're not that tough. Damn. Rivet Knuckle. Yo. Slicer. Bullets. And a desert eagle. Alright, let me level up one more time. Hang on. <laughs> it's not good. I <laughs> a bullock knife. I mean, it's stronger than an attack knife, but it's still not good. <laughs> there we go.
All right, let's go. So you're Hawk. He resembles you quite a bit. His power is nearly identical to yours. Can you decide on an appropriate name for him? Yes, his name is... Deleth. So you will name him Deleth then? Yes. So he is named Deleth. I see. Hey, what are you looking at? Listen when I'm talking to you. I gotta admit, you've got guts to ignore me like that. Or maybe you're just a fool. Hawk. You've done quite well making it up the ranks this far. I applaud your fighting prowess. And... I mourn your impending death. Oh, I got a star glove. Only one more win. One more, and I'd be... Champion. I... Could have... Gone to the center. We have a winner. Hawk is the champion. The new champion is Hawk. The new champion is... Ah, this is great. Managing the champ. I finally got a decent gym and showed up that pansy Hinata. Not only that, I'm finally out of debt and can buy stuff around town too. Keep winning and making us both rich. If you keep winning, the madam will take notice and call us to her mansion. <laughs> oh, madam. D uh, Hawk, what the hell are you looking at me like that for? Oh yeah, not only this, but you get to become an official resident of the center. Eh? Looks like someone's here to see you. Is the new champion, Hawk, here? Ah, there you are. My name is Hiroko. I've come here from the center. Oh, and what would a center resident like yourself want with us? As the new champion, I need your help. Ooh, where did that go? Oh, okay. <laughs> Something flew across. I need your help to find someone. About six months ago, there was an accident in the center where there was a large explosion. In the confusion, a little boy disappeared. Actually, it turns out that the accident really wasn't an accident at all. It was deliberately set up by two scientists named Makata and Hanada, both of whom disappeared right afterwards. After the explosion, I searched for the little boy, but couldn't find any trace of him anywhere. I think the two scientists took him with them. Through some digging around, I discovered that one of the scientists, Hanada, has been hiding in Madame's mansion in Valhalla. The security of Madame's mansion is really tight, and she never lets anyone in normally. But they say she always summons new champions there to congratulate them on their victory. Please, take me with you. I can't get into that mansion any other way. Yes. R really? Thank you, champion. Hey now, the champion's too busy to be bothered with your missing persons, Hunt. Ah, uh, what the hell. I guess it's alright. Hiroko joined the party. 
Looks like you've got another visitor. You're the new champion Hawk, no? I'm a messenger from Madam. She would very much like to meet you. Please come to her mansion when you are free. Here, this is an invitation from Madam. Please do not bring any more than one guest with you. We will be waiting for you at the mansion. You got the invitation. Aw, uh, you gotta be kidding me! Only one guest? Ah, don't worry about me, though. You promised the girl you take her. Best not to go back on it. I'll be here if you ever need me. Go ahead, have fun. So you have an invitation. You're the new champion, Hawk. Please, please come in. Take the elevator upstairs. She is yours. Give her an appropriate name. Her name is... Her name is Beth. Beth. Is this all right? Yes. Beth. Yes, that's a good name. Well, well, the new champion. I am honored to meet you. Madam is waiting for you. Madam, the new champion has arrived. Greetings. I am the one that governs Valhalla. Everyone calls me Madam. The officials at the center have left the control of everything here in Valhalla to me. People have flocked to Valhalla to visit the Colosseum and casinos we have opened here, devoting themselves to the purest of all sorts of earthly delights. And as a result, peace has flourished in Valhalla. With all sorts of pleasures at one's fingertips, the residents here live out their lives without conflict. Do you not think this is a great accomplishment? I am very proud of Valhalla. I think it is an ideal place to live. Take a look at this. This is the core of Millennium, which controls all aspects of life in this city. The center. The officials in the center intend to tighten their grip on the city and control people's lives to a greater extent. However, I plan on leaving Val Valhalla the way it is now, as a free area. However, recently there was an incident which has caused me some trouble. There was a scientist that had been working for me here for the past while, but he ran away. He intends to open a portal to the Abyss and summon a horde of demons to the surface. The reason I called you here to my estate is that I would like you to find him and bring him back to me. As you have won the tournament, I know that you are a capable man. Would you please assist me? The scientist's name is Hanada. Hanada? Then Hanada isn't here? No, he is not. He has fled somewhere to the slum district. Where, I do not know. I leave the matter in your hands, Hawk. Oh yes, that's right. Let me lend you my pet to assist you in your search. Cerberus, come here. Hey there, Pascal. <laughs> Be Cerberus will lend you his power. He is quite powerful, and surely will prove a trustworthy and reliable helper. Cerberus, don't just sit there. Greet the man. So you're Hawk, the new champion, eh? 
Normally, I wouldn't associate with low-level weak humans such as you, but as Madam requests it, I'll go along with you. I am at your service, for the time being. The Cerberus became your minion. Very well. I look forward to hearing good news, Hawk. No, 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 no. Okay. Not that way. Right. Go right. Valhalla is a free area. Not even the center can dictate what we do. Ha <laughs> ha, Maya. Seems that lately there have been fewer and fewer tournaments. Could be that you end up being the final champion. A long time ago, this town was teeming with demons, but now they only pop up every once in a while. Apparently, a scientist working for Madam has been summoning all the demons that they've been using in the Colosseum. They say Maka is being produced in the Abyss by Lucifuge, one of Lucifer's subordinates. I can smell him to the left. Medicine. Keep going forward, then go right. Since they built Millennium, Gaia adherence has really been suffering. The Temple Knights will kick anyone will kill anyone openly practicing any other religion, so we've been forced to go underground. This is the Temple of Gaia. What do you need? Nothing from you. May chaos be brought to the world. Head to the right and go further down the stairs. I can detect a scent from the floor below. Hmm. 
Nice. Money. <laughs> Here we go. Why, you little... This is the laboratory of the master genius, the great Dr. Hanada. Stay out. I'm at a critical point here. What? You've come to take me back? Like hell you will. A master genius like me needs to be able to perform his experiments without restriction. Since neither those thick-headed zealots in the center, nor the old fart madam seems to be able to understand that, I have gone off to do my research by myself. And guess what? That unrestricted research has produced nothing less than a tunnel straight to the abyss. No longer will I have to perform all these stupid, menial tasks by myself. From now on, I'll summon as many demons as I need to help me. To start with, I'll take the artifacts I need. First, the laughing doll. N next, the crying doll. After that, the angry doll. And last but not least, the dancing doll. With the power contained within these four statues, all I need to do is place them in the right formation, in an area whose energy is close to being in tune with the abyss, and the door will open. Behold! <coughs> Ow. Okay, M Mercurius. Kill those little punks who want to disrupt my research. Wait, you're supposed to kill them, not me. Hi. Okay. The four statues that Hanada used are here. Laughing doll, crying doll, angry doll, and dancing doll were found. Okay. Yo, another slicer? Aw, oh, she can't equip it. Sad.
Yo, that was easy. Awesome. Sorry, Cerberus, but you're leaving, so... What's this about my level being too low? How do I... Hmm. Maybe at a certain point? Hey, cat. Well, what level is... Uh, what level are you? Twelve... And then you're six and you're seven. Hmm. Interesting. Hang on. Let me try this real quick. Ooh. Comparatively, I will take this. I'm wilder by corn. Okay. Welcome, Sir Hawk. Please go inside. I apologize for keeping you waiting, Sir Hawk. I shall let Madam know that you are here. Well then, it's time for me to say farewell. You couldn't bring Hanada back alive, but you're a pretty tough one. I like you, kid. I hope that we will meet again. Cerberus left. Hawk, thank you for your efforts. I had thought that you would be able to bring Hanada back alive. I'm a bit disappointed, but what's done is done. By the way, someone is here to see you. He is a messenger from the center. So you're Hawk, the new champion. Think! Remember your true name. Your name is... So, you've awakened. Whether or not you choose to be a servant of God, or an agent of the demons, either way, it is a great gamble. A gamble on which the fate of all humanity rests. So, it is now time. Identify yourself as you will. So... Your name is Aleph. Aleph, you have chosen a good name. Aleph, how about it? Has it come back to you? My name is Zayan. I've been searching for you for quite a long time. You might not remember it, but you were originally a resident of the center, Aleph. Also, Hiroko, you have also been ordered to return to the center. The two of you should come with me. We are going back to the center. My, this is a surprise. 
to think that you were a center citizen all along. What a shame you wouldn't have had to go all... You wouldn't have had to go to all that trouble risking your life in the Colosseum had you known. This isn't the sort of place that you belong in. Hurry and return to the center. Ah, you finally arrived. Or should I say, you finally returned. In any case, I am overjoyed to see that you are both alright. Here, this ID card is yours. At last, I can give it to its rightful owner. You've got the resident ID card. As for you, Hiroko, you should have known better than to run off like that. The Temple Knights are our most glorious and prestigious order, and it does not look well upon us that one of them decides to arbitrarily leave the center like that. I, won I would like a full explanation from you in a moment. Guards, could you escort Hiroko inside to my office? Thank you so much for all your help, Aleph. It's too bad that we were never able to find that little boy, but I appreciate you sticking your neck out for me like that. I hope I'll see you again. Well then, Aleph, welcome back to the center. Right before you were kidnapped and brought from the center, Makata erased your memories. As a result, you remember neither your true identity nor the divine mission that you, that was bestowed upon you. Aleph, you are to become our savior. Your birth was a fulfillment of the ancient prophecy, foretold by John in the Book of Revelations. You are destined to become the Messiah. You have been given wondrous powers with which you can bring salvation to the people of the world. In the past, a great city known as Tokyo once stood upon this land, but was destroyed in a cataclysmic war. From the ashes of the city, we built a new city, this Millennium. Millennium's purpose is to actualize the Thousand Year Kingdom, an age where the people would live in peace forever. And in order for Millennium to truly become the Thousand Year Kingdom, we needed a messiah to guide us. And so you were born in... And so you were born. In you, God himself has given unto us a savior. To aid you in your most holiest of missions, God also gave us one that would be a fitting partner for the one who would become the messiah. Beth, you may enter. Welcome back. Or so I'd say, but you don't remember me or this place, do you? Poor Aleph. But don't worry, I am with you now, and will remain so from now on. You'll soon start to remember things you've forgotten, a little bit at a time, and will eventually return to your old self. And I will never leave your side, ever. Beth has joined the party. Aleph, there is a dire situation in the Holy Town District. King Frost has frozen over the entire area with his powerful ice magic. And if that weren't enough, Basilisk is also rampaging there, breathing thick clouds of its deadly toxic breath throughout the entire district, claiming many innocent lives. Please, save the people of Holy Town. Go into the western exit from the center. If you enter the passcode 0352 in the security door there, you can enter Holy Town. Uh, do I still have that written down? Hang on, let me check. Check to make sure I still have all that. Yes, I still have all that written down. Perfect. Twenty-four. Oh yeah, she's 24 and she only has like 70 fucking health. It's it's absurdly bad. I, I, I forgot about that. 
Uh, no. Yes. Uh, nothing. Our daughter has always been gifted, and even became a temple knight. Hiroko was always such a good girl. Why would she do something as awful as leaving the center without permission? Are there absolutely zero items in this area? There might be literally no items to find. Because I don't see any. Nothing like right off the bat. forgot <laughs> I like went to scratch my fucking back and then immediately forgot how the video game worked uh okay uh yeah so that's it welcome to the virtual battler hi so you're working hard to strengthen yourself in the Virtual Battler, eh? Very good, very good. In my Demon Summoning program, working this way is supposed to. Put a lot of effort into it over the years. I have something else I would like to give you. This is a Devil Analyzer. You can record the data of any and every demon you encounter. You should find it useful, so use it well. I'll upload it to your terminal now. Look forward to our next meeting. Perfect. Wow. <laughs> to think that I finally get to kick back and live easy after all that time risking my butt fighting in Valhalla. When I became the champion, I looked all cool and composed, but in reality I was really stressed. Losing equates to death, and that's pretty rough, you know. God will be sending us his messiah soon. Those who believe will all be saved. Welcome. Let me tell you about the four entrances to the center. North leads to Valhalla, east to Arcadia, west to Holy Town, south to the factory. Hey, glad to see you made it back in one piece, Aleph. Let's work together for the glory of Millennium. By the way, do you still remember the passcode to get up to floor 21? In case you've forgotten, it's 5261. I'm so happy living here in the center. All my needs are taken care of and there are no demons. But there's... so there's nothing to worry about. So I hear that Basilisk is running around Holy Town, breathing poison gas everywhere. Not the kind of place I'd want to be right now. God will be sending us his messiah soon. I was told recently that there are five temple knights of superior ability that the center has been watching closely, where it hasn't that one of them might be the messiah. I've heard that maka is money that's produced by demons. 
I think it's kind of odd that we would use that sort of money as our primary currency in a God-fearing country like Millennium. I wonder if using the Moragi stones is improved because of my, uh, me uh, upping my magic. That might be interesting if true. Oh yeah, code breakers. That if that's true, then the stones. Uh, have a better purpose than what I originally thought they were, which was, hey, if you want to do, like, exactly five damage, then <laughs> you use a uh, magic stone. Because those fucking stones seem to just be worthless <laughs> otherwise. The center told us you were coming. Please go through. Uh, zero, three, five, two. Yes. Let's get Bicorn out here. Drake Basilisk. He ran away. Looks like it wants to fight. Here we go. Critical strike. Good job with shocking him when he's already uh, attacked. You know, that's great.
Yeah. Yeah. Door is frozen over and will not open. Okay. Oh, God. Uh, so much for all the experience that we could have got. So cold. Um, I have no idea how much these guys hit. Okay, they they're weaker. Damn it, they were weaker than the Frankenstein's monsters. If I had known, I would have gone for it. Uh, no, no, you scare me. I need to be a much higher level for you. <laughs> Definitely not that. Healing, I have HP MP status. Heal everyone, I will. 2,000 Maka, I will take. Mm. That hurts. Hang on. You motherfucker lied! You didn't heal everyone. He only heals those in my party. Fuck off. Fine. Fucking fine, dickhead. Hi. 
Hee ho, hee hee ho. I'm in a really good mood. I want to freeze everything I want. You want me to stop? Well, then I'll freeze you. There we go. Wait a minute. It's not actually doing what I wanted. Thank you. Do you want something, man-child? Yes. Brave one. I thought as much. I'll remember that. here. Just going to ignore everything else because no point. There we go. Don't do this to me. Thank you.
Wait, what? You cannot use this term. Why not? Good. Okay. Are you returning to the center? Please take care. There we go. Aleph, you have done wonderfully, driving the demons out of Holy Town. While you were gone, I debriefed Hiroko, and she told me about Hanada's death. It would seem the man had far too much confidence in his own abilities. With him gone, the only rebel left is Makata. But where on earth is he, I wonder? He is a dangerous man, far more dangerous than Hanada was. If we leave him be, there's no telling what he might do. Your Holiness. Your Holiness, it's awful. I see. Thank you for bringing this to my attention. Aleph, it would appear we have another emergency on our hands. Within the factory district, there is a large excavation and mining project being undertaken underground and the evil demon built Betelgeese? Betelgeese? Betelgeese has appeared there and has taken over the entire site. At the same time, and perhaps as a result of his influence, several of the Demi-Nandi we have been breeding for food have gone on a rampage in the farming areas of the district. The factory is an essential part of our city and both our resources and the workers there are in grave danger. Please, defeat Betelgeese and the Deminandi, and save the citizens of the factory. You can get to the factory through an underground tunnel from the center's, su from the center center's southern exit. The passcode for the security lock to the factory area is 6191. Virtuals. Okay. Perfect. Center told us you were coming. The 
The factory here is the industrial center of Millennium. It's where we produce all the commodities that the residents of the city need to survive. Labor is my joy. Labor is my reason for living. Yes! There we go. Oh yeah, I was working hard today on the epitome of labor. Normally I'd be down in the third division to getting up machines part, but since the demons have been showing up down there, I can't risk continuing to be... It really sucks not being able to work. We raised demi nadis for their meat and milk in the western farms and ranches in the area, but recently the Nandis have been getting violent and attacking anyone that comes near. The workers in this area sure seem happy. Do they really enjoy working that much? Hi. God, work was hard today. I'll have to work harder tomorrow. Blessed is the man that toils. God extends his hand to the salvation to all those that work hard. still have that list of uh, Mega Ten or Shin Megami Tensei 2 items up. So let me take a look. Uh, there we go. Okay. Although there's the frog helm. Okay, I'll just take the frog helm. Take one of those. Well, will I actually? Hmm, hang on. Arm bridges is female only. Take you. Oh, hang on.
damn, that's a lot, actually. Aerojet. Yeah. I'll definitely be back for those, though. Because that'll increase my speed. Valhalla. Double ill. Oh. Oh. Oh, come on. Oh, Tarunda. Oh, there he is. So there's this guy compared to this girl. Doesn't have a lot, but she has Tarunda. take you. Actually, no, I won't. I'm gonna take you, because I'm pretty sure I can find them, like, as soon as I get to Shinjuku. If I remember correctly. They're like wild demons. to the factory. Okay. God, I hate that. <laughs> I, I hate hitting that button. <laughs> uh, 
There we go. Next to you, the other Deminatis have calmed down. We really owe you one. There we go. Labor is my joy. Labor is my reason for living. The ground shook with an earthquake. A left. It's actually a resident of the center all along. Is that all they're gonna say? Oh! The old man who works at the factory has given a donation of 10,000 maka to the Messiah Church. Mr. Takamura, age 78, has been working for 50 years, slowly putting money into a savings fund a bit at a time. He brought the entire 10,000 maka he had saved to the church yesterday. We should all strive to be as faithful and generous as he is. Nice.
Oh, wait. Um... No. It's not you. Does it only record the ones that I have fought since acquiring this? If that's the case, then yeah, I don't think I would have it. Oh, you're pure neutral. You're dark neutral. Windigo is also dark neutral. Dark neutral. Okay. This place is off limits. Yes! Had a feeling. <clears throat> Level 14, that's pretty good. Yo, I got a what? Yo? Okay, I'm giving this to you, but I'm taking it away before the boss. Oh, oh, give that to me, give that to me, give that to me, give that to fucking me! Okay. <laughs> There's way too many of you. A magic box. There's no gem inside. What a surprise. Hi, fallen battle geese. I forgot to summon. That's fine. Why Beth again?
thank you for hitting someone else. Sapphire out of it, and we leveled up. There we go. Thanks for taking care of Betelgeuse. Now I can finally work at full strength. Okay, not exactly yes, but I guess. <laughs> Ah, oh, Beth, you finally leveled up. Still not enough to get that M16. Ah. I am going to grind for a little bit for money. Because I want money. Give me money. Not enough money. <laughs> better money. <laughs> also better money. Ooh. <laughs> I hate that. I, I hate doing it. <laughs> Ooh, two life stones? 
Yo, jackpot. All right, I'm gonna talk to you. sucks I feel like going delinquent not true chuckle damn you Your funeral. Nope. <laughs> I'm just going to keep doing this until I get more money. Nope, not you. <laughs> ah, fuck, it's full moon. Oh well. Can we talk this out? <laughs> Go away. <laughs> nice. Nice. Ah. Oh. Pain. My desert eagle. Alrighty. Nope. Scorpion whip? <laughs> Teleport me to the center. Let me save, continue, yes, and leave. Okay. Hey, yeah. Uh, you've been doing one heck of a job saving all those citizens of the city. Thanks a lot. I don't know what we'd do without you. 
By the way, there's something I've been meaning to show you. For a while. Head to the Arcadia area. Arcadia is an experimental area of the city we've been working on to try and create an ideal world for the coming of the Thousand Year Kingdom. It's got special environmental controls, technology, and... Well, you should see for yourself. Anyhow, Gimel is there. Do you remember him? If you still can't, you should go see him. Maybe he'll jog your memory. You can get to Arcadia from the eastern gate in the center. The passcode to get in is 9103. Hang on. Okay. Ooh, a unicorn. Tarukaja. Hang on, I'm I'm curious. Yo. <laughs> All right, hang on. They all give you that. But because it's not a question mark, I can't do it. Okay. That's a unicorn. That's also a unicorn. Do they have different special abilities? Oops. <laughs> This all right? Yes. Nekamata, Tarukaja, and Rakukaja. And then there's Apis, who is not that good. Because you have both of those. No. <laughs> All right. That's good enough for me. Back to the center. What was it? 9103? Yeah! There we go. Yes. Please connect your arm terminal to the port in front of you to access the computer for authorization. Dun -dun 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 -dun. I am the champion, the strongest man in Valhalla. It is only fitting that such a strong, beautiful man such as myself be chosen to live in Arcadia. Look! Look at my beautiful body! My rippling muscles, my exquisite face. Ah.
We can live here in peace and harmony, and it's all thanks to Lord Gimmel. Lord Gimmel is truly our savior. Lord Gimmel is in the mansion at the end of the path that runs through the trees. Wait, was there... I don't think there was any items in here. Yeah. Later on there is, but not right now. Right now it's just talking to people. Oh, my beloved Arcadia, you are so wonderful. This is truly an ideal world. Anything? Doesn't look like there's anything new. Those of us here in Arcadia can live without worrying about any of the tragedies or disasters in the outside world. However, we still cannot escape death. If we can find the secret to immortality, then we will have nothing left to fear. Thanks to our savior, Lord Gimmel. We can live here happily in complete freedom. However, there are still some people here that crave immortality. Humans sure are greedy. They always want something more. Me, I'm pretty happy as I am. This certainly is a welcome sight. It's been quite a long time, Aleph. It's me, Gimmel. Do you remember me? So, what do you think of the Arcadia area? While you were gone missing, I was put in charge of this area, and have built it into a microcosm of a future utopian world. As I'm sure you already know, Millennium is trying to bring the Thousand Year Kingdom into reality. The Arcadia area here is the, an experimental test case in an isolated environment to see what kind of world we can create once the Thousand Year Kingdom becomes reality. So far, it's been a great success. Here, there are no demons, and hence no need to fight. The interpersonal conflicts between individuals have been eradicated as well. Everyone lives in peace and harmony. Once the entire world has been made like Arcadia, we really can say that the Thousand Year Kingdom has come. Aleph, if you like it here, you can come back whenever you desire. You are always welcomed here in the halls of Arcadia. Alright then, please go back to the center and tell Zayn that Arcadia has been an overwhelming success. Mm. Actually... Damn it. Press the wrong fucking button. <laughs> oh, a left. All hell's breaking loose. Broken loose. I haven't got time to explain. Go talk to the bishop. This is horrible. The demons have finally managed to break into the center. And what's worse, the anti messiah has also shown himself. This false savior is deviously manipulating the innocent populace. If we let him continue, Millennium will surely fall into a state of utter chaos. We will have receiving reports of the Anti-Messiah's activity from both Holy Town and Valhalla, but we don't know exactly where he is at the present time. For that reason, 
For what reason is he claiming to be the savior? Please, try and find out. Alrighty. Uh-oh. <laughs> Alrighty. Uh, how long have I been recording? Yeah, I think it's... Oh, God. Uh, I think this is a good place to sp uh, stop. We've gone through a lot, actually. Um, we're, like, almost done with the first third of the game, with, like, the first act. Uh... Yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and stop here. Thank you all for watching, especially if you got this far and stick around, because there's a lot more to come.